Hey, good morning, good afternoon, or good evening, wherever it may be. Craig Hiking Pipes, and my second video of this Friday. Uh, it's the afternoon, and uh, we're getting a little bit of a thunderstorm, rainstorm. Love sitting on the porch um, when we're having these kind of storms and listening to the thunder and the rain, and it's just a really great time to smoke a pipe. One of my favorites. Uh, smoking my Asikian, and in it some Tilbury. Mm. So, this video is going out to Matthew, Mozilla. And he is uh, celebrating as the wrong word, but acknowledging the anniversary of his father's passing. And as such, he's commemorating the passing of his father uh, with a really nice memorial giveaway. And what Matthews asked us to do is talk about any interaction we had with Ladon Mott. That's his father. So, unfortunately, I didn't have any direct interaction with Ladon Mott. Um, however, he was influential to me. Um, I've only been really engaged, as I said previously in a video, uh, with the YTPC for about seven or eight months, eight months perhaps. But prior to that, as I was getting into the pipe smoking, uh, of course I was checking out videos galore on YouTube, and uh, he happened to be one of the gentlemen that I actually watched fairly frequently. Um, it was interesting to see how many pipes he would get. Uh, it, uh, I remember kind of chuckling. It seemed like almost every other video he was, uh, he was doing a pipe opening of some sort, getting lots of tobacco. But as I was looking for pipes, being a real novice, um, I always enjoyed watching and him showing off the pipes. So it kind of helped me learn about different shapes and different styles of pipe. Um, again, I'm really sorry it was unfortunate that uh, I didn't have any direct interaction with him, but, um, you know, Matthew, it has to be great to have a dad that was, um, you know, influential with you. And one thing that was also very, very evident that came through in his videos is his love for his family, especially the grandchildren. He, that seemed to be the light of his eye. Um, he would say very frequently that he would always look forward to the grandchildren coming over and spending time and playing games with them. And it just seemed to create a, a, a spark of liveliness when he would talk about that. So that was very evident that uh, the, his family was, was the shining light for him. And that was, that was really, truly nice to see. So, you know, as much as one can get to know another through just watching videos without any direct dialogue, um, obviously his love for pipes his love for tobacco, but most of all, I took away his love for his family, and again, most notably, his uh, grandchildren. So, Matthew, I'm really sorry um, that uh, you're... The words are tough. Um, having to commemorate this one year anniversary on a very sad occasion, but I think it's something that he would appreciate and uh, be very thankful for. So 
I hope this video came across okay, guys, um, and Matthew, of course. So, again, Matthew, um, my condolences, but uh, he seemed like a really nice man, and uh, I'm just sorry I didn't get to know him personally. So, for everybody else out there um, who sees this, check out Modzilla. Uh, that's his YouTube name, Matthew, and you can also check out his father's video, Ladam Mod. Um, all his videos are up. I think he had over 700 videos. He was doing it for many, many years, six, seven years he was making videos, and um, again, very nice man. So go check both of these out. With that, be well. Be safe and be good to one another. We'll talk to you again very soon. Bye for now.